suggest the women in the West do if everyone's advice is for men in the West to look elsewhere for a wife? What happens to all the women in the West then? Well, that one study we referenced that said by 2030, 50% of the women will be without a man. So that's, that's the direction we're heading. Because the men that are looking for those traditional values are starting to go overseas. And then two, the other half of the men are just checking out completely. They don't want to deal with women at all. So this is going to be a big issue that women are going to deal with in the future as their options dwindle. Now think about that. By 2030, this is 2023, so seven years. So you take, let's say you take a woman that's 21 right now. In seven years, she'll be 28. She'll be getting close to that time in her life where she has to make a decision if she's going to have children or not. Because the older you, you know, the longer you wait, the more complications you could have. Not to mention the more eggs you lose. So just imagine that woman at 28 years old facing this scope of what they're describing. Men are going to be gone. 50% of women are not going to have a mate. Sounds like a recipe for a lot of lonely, broken hearts. I think that, in my personal opinion, I think that animals are just going to replace children. Until we get to a point where we have to force people to actually have children. Force people to actually have a family unit. Because, you know, we were the strongest. I'm in America, so I'm going to talk about that. But if you look over time and you look in history, despite what people tell you about how women were slaves back in the day and all that, <clears throat> people were the most happy back then. People got more done back then. People were able to build, you know, legacies back then. By 2030, it's gone. It's gone. And it's all because of this empowerment of women thinking that they need to be separate. They need to be in competition. They need to have just as much as a man does or be able to do everything that a man does. But they want to be selective about that. They don't want to go do the jobs that men do that can cost their lives. They don't want to do the, the hard jobs. So they want to pick and choose. Hell, a lot of women don't even want to take out the trash. So by 2030, we're going to have this huge gap of all these women looking back saying, damn, why did I listen to that? I've seen countless videos of women crying, regretting that they didn't have children and understanding that, wow, I really missed the boat. Hey guys, thanks for watching this video review. If you could do me a favor, like and subscribe to my channel. There should be a button down at the bottom right of this video. If you're on TikTok, please go ahead and just click the heart button and give me a follow. I'd appreciate it. Thanks a lot again and have a great one.